What's going on guys? This is JT here. It's about five in the morning my time. My dog just woke me up right quick. Whenever I woke up, I signed on. Of course, I was on my free to play account and I saw this new hero collector event and I was like, what dude? Oh, another thing before I talk about it, I wanted to let you guys know if anybody wants me to roll on your account today, tomorrow, whenever, my new line ID is JT is all business 17. We'll gladly roll for pretty much any event and make videos of it obviously that helps my youtube channel out when you guys give me rolling sessions plus i love to do it so if anybody wants me to roll my uh line ideas jt is all business 17. all right so and I'll, i'm gonna be going to sleep uh after this for like three more hours and then i'll be back on obviously making videos but i saw this event and i was like man do i want to just just not wait on hero collector anymore and maybe just go right into this one i'm not a hundred percent sure and i wanted to get y'all's opinion and let me know what you guys think so today's hero collector on ios if you roll a succubus obviously if you do a rolling session you're probably going to get a succubus you'll probably get like four of them so you're going to get the five fine enchantment crest pack right there obviously Pumpkin Duke, I mean, he's not really like a hidden hero. This is kind of what makes me want to do Hero Collector today is Pumpkin Duke's prize. It's like, you know, they don't give you too many opportunities to get the Smashing Pumpkin Scraps as free to play. So I was like, that's a pretty freaking sweet reward. And I did uh, find out from IGG that they're going to be putting in more rewards like this in the future, like uh, Scraps. So they're gonna have like a bunch of scraps, like Skull Knight scraps, for example, Michael scraps, all kinds of different scraps are gonna be coming to Hero Collector. But I don't know if they're changing the odds to rolling the heroes, which I doubt they are, but I always feel like I'm suspicious, but yeah, I highly doubt they are. So we also have, this is what makes me not want to roll Hero Collector, Professor Ribbit and Anubis' prize. It's like, I don't really want bulwark you know what i mean and obviously professor ribbit that is whatever it's more just a simple fact of the talent that it gives for rolling them the 15 gelatinous champions are great the books are great anubis and power is pretty sweet you know especially for free to play but it's like honestly i don't really care about either one of those talents i want some of the new stuff right either regenerate or iron will but here's what makes me really like considered it's like okay crystal oozes like really you need 15 oozes and you get a rock no you get 10 of these ceramic rock ones which is 3000 fame and then you get 30 pet bag twos which even have a chance of giving the new pet so it's like oh my gosh i might just roll for 15 crystal oozes but it's like how many gems would you have to spend to get 15 crystal is it quite worth to just take a big chunk out of my gems to because to get 15 crystal oozes i'm guessing that's probably around honestly don't know but probably like 15,000 gems maybe a thousand per crystal ooze i'm guessing it's probably a good estimate it could be 20,000 gems so it's like do i want to go in and spend 20,000 gems today on hero collector I, I would not like in the two talents that it gives you know what I mean or do I want to leave myself a door to where they have like I don't know a dove keeper here and a storm eater and they're giving out regenerate crest set with let's say an iron will talent or something something better I don't know I just don't simply like bulwark like I don't need I don't even need bulwark on my free to play you know what I mean and then empower is kind of like the same thing it's not it, like one empower talent doesn't really uh it's not really gonna help my free-to-play account to be honest with you so i don't really like i said i don't really care for either one of those, so i don't really know i do love the pumpkin duke what do you guys think are you guys gonna be rolling today for this hero collector i don't think it's worth it i think maybe what i'm gonna do is make a video and roll on my uh main account see how many gems it takes to get crystal oozes and if it's something like 10k i'll probably do it on my free-to-play and then if it's something like 20k I don't know, I might hold off. I'm honestly not 100% sure what I want to do with this event, to be honest. I don't know, it's a tough call. Rock Nose seems pretty nice. I'm already at 100 uh, soul stones right now, or getting close to 100, so let me see how many soul stones I'm at. I know I got at least 50. I'm over 50, I know that. Let's see, we're at 12 Walla soul stones, 67. All right, so I got 67 Walla, so, I mean uh, Rock Nose soul stones. And that's purely from Arid Runes, just from keeping up with Arid Runes on the daily. So yeah, I mean, I would have a backup 
freaking Rockno and or actually a main Rockno and then have another backup one eventually so I don't know the new pet makes me want to roll just the crystal ooze is just so attaching it's like ah oh, crystal oozes are just so easy to roll should I do it and then I'm like no I should save wait for better talents it's like what you what to do what to do <laughs> anyway guys I'm about to go back hit the sack I just saw this event and I was like this event's kind of crazy man. I'm gonna make a video on this right quick and yeah if anybody wants me to roll later today remember line ID JT is all business 17 Thanks, guys. Y'all are freaking awesome, and I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Peace out, fellas.